So let's turn to prayer as we pray for our world and our nation. <clears throat> the word of the Lord came to Isaiah and God said to all people, cease to do evil. Lord, we hold before you a world battered by evil, the evil of abuse and neglect, war and oppression. And we pray for your peace and justice. God said, learn to do good. And Lord, we thank you for the goodness of many, the generosity and compassion of people of many faiths and backgrounds. And we hold before you those in our community doing good today. We pray, Lord, your strength, your encouragement of all involved in One Can and Wickham Homeless Connection, and Refugee Partnership and many other groups making a difference in our area. And God says, seek justice, rescue the oppressed. Lord, we pray for those newly elected as members of parliament, for integrity, that they may seek the common good and especially serve the needs of the vulnerable. And we hold before you all with power and influence in the nations of the world that the oppressed may go free, justice may be renewed, and all led into your ways of peace. And God said, defend the orphans, plead for the widows. And so, Lord, we pray for the vulnerable in our community and our world those without families to support them, those without a home, those grieving the death of a loved one, those struggling with illness or disability. And in the silence we hold before you those we know, praying your peace and healing for them. Hear our prayers, Lord, silent and spoken. They are offered in Jesus' name. <clears throat> 